B.O.B. Bobby Ray Simmons, Jr., better known by his stage name B.O.B., is an American hip-hop recording artist, singer-songwriter and record producer from Decatur, Georgia. In 2006, B.O.B. was discovered by Brian Richardson, who then brought him to T.J. Chapman, who then brought him to American record producer Jim Johnson. After hearing his music, Johnson subsequently signed B.O.B. to his Rebel Rock Entertainment imprint. A couple of years later, Johnson and B.O.B. signed a joint venture deal with Atlantic and American rapper T.I.'s Grand Hustle Records. B.O.B. quickly rose to fame after his commercial debut single Nothing On You, reached number one in both the United States and the United Kingdom. He would later release his third single Airplanes, which also topped several music charts. His fifth single Magic, became his third top ten hit on the Billboard Hot 100. B.O.B.'s debut studio album The Adventures of Bobby Ray, which was preceded by two extended plays, EPs, and several mixed ups, was released on April 27, 2010. The album reached number one on the U.S. Billboard charts and was eventually certified gold by the Recording Industry Association of America, RIAA. Later that year, B.O.B. was named the ninth hottest MC in the game of 2010 by MTV, on their annual list. B.O.B. released his second studio album Strange Clouds, on May 1, 2012. Strange Clouds spawned six singles, four of which charted exceptionally well internationally. The song Strange Clouds, the album's eponymous lead single, became his fourth top ten hit on the Billboard Hot 100. The single's so good, both of us, and out of my mind, followed behind, with the former two being certified platinum by the RIAA. The album itself debuted at number 5 on the Billboard 200. His third album Underground Luxury, was released in December 2013 and supported by the lead single Headband. B.O.B. is currently working on the Grand Hustle compilation album and is set to release an EP which will only include rock music, as well as a collaborative album with his Grand Hustle label boss T.I., all in the near future. Biography 1988-2006, Early Life and Career Beginnings Simmons was born on November 15, 1988 in Winston-Salem, North Carolina. He played the trumpet in his school band from elementary school through high school. Although his parents wanted him to continue his education, Simmons decided in sixth grade that he wanted to pursue a music career. His father, a pastor, disapproved of his son's choices until he realized that Simmons was using music as a form of therapy and a creative outlet. Simmons later reflected on his experience, saying, They've always supported me. They got my first keyboard to make beats in and they helped me out getting equipment here and there. But it was kind of hard for them to really understand what I was really trying to accomplish. B.O.B. attended Columbia High School in Decatur, Georgia. After meeting his mentor and co-manager, B. Rich, in 2002 at 14 years of age, B.O.B. sold his first beat to former Slip and Slide recording artist City for a song titled I'm the Cookie Man. Meanwhile B.O.B. felt he had made it, I went and blew all of my money on fast stuff like a chain and ballin. Soon I was broke again, but I learned two important things from it. Make sure I saved my money and that I was hooked on music. Back to square one, B.O.B. continued performing at open mix and underground venues to perfect his craft. In 2006, because he was underage, B. Rich helped sneak B.O.B. into Club Crucial, a nightclub owned by Atlanta rapper T.I. There, B.O.B. performed a song titled Cloud Nine, a self-produced, spoken word-like ode to marijuana. In attendance was producer and industry veteran, T.J. Chapman. CEO of TJ's DJs. TJ Chapman agreed to co-manage B.O.B., which only a month later led to B.O.B.'s signing with Atlantic Records and subsidiary imprint Rebel Rock, run by Florida producer Jim Johnson. His first single for Atlantic, 2007's Hate Hurts Everywhere, reached a top five of Billboard's Bubbling Under R and B Hip Hop Singles chart. Along with his solo production career, B.O.B. is part of a production rap group called Ham Squad, along with Playboy Ta, DJ Swats, DJ Smooth, 
Moss B. B. Rich and T.J. Chapman. 2007-2008, Rise to Fame and Mixtapes. B.O.B. first began to gain major recognition at the start of 2007. The underground single, Hate Hurts Everywhere, featuring Wee's Fifth, gained the rapper recognition and peaked at number 5 on the U.S. Billboard Bubbling Under Hot 100 singles. A remix featuring Rich Boy was included in the video game Fight Night Round 4, and a music video was later released for that version. Another single, I'll Be In The Sky, was released in late 2008 reached number 115 on the follow chart. About.com called the song a smart, funky art rap and a strong prelude to his album, and included it at number 13 on its subjective ranking top 100 rap songs of 2008. Incidentally, another song produced by Bobby Ray called Generation Lost listed alongside the song on the ranking at number 32. This was followed by another single called Don't Let Me Fall, which was more of an NB song than the usual rap. He was also featured on T.I.'s album Paper Trail on the song On Top of the World. The same year, he appeared on the cover of XXL magazine along with Asher Roth, Charles Hamilton, and Whale as Hip Hop's class of 09. In October 2008, B.O.B. was featured on the cover of Vibe along with some of these same young musicians and was similarly identified as promising young talent. He has described his influences as 80s music, techno, rock, funk, even doo-wop. B.O.B. has also worked with artists such as British rapper Giggs. From 2007 to 2008 B.O.B. released four mixed apps. The Future, 2007, Cloud 9, 2007, Hi. My name is B.O.B., 2008, Who the FK is B.O.B., 2008, and two extended plays. East, 2007, 12th Dimension, 2008. 2008 to 2010, Mainstream Success and the Adventures of Bobby Ray. In late 2008, it was revealed B.O.B. was included in XXL's 2009 annual freshman class and was featured on the cover alongside fellow up-and-coming rappers Asher Roth, Whale, Kid Cudi, Charles Hamilton, Corey Guns, Blue, Mickey F.A.C.T.Z., Ace Hood and Curran Dollar Y. In February 2009, B.O.B. crafted an original song, titled Auto-Tune, for Grand Theft Auto, The Lost and Damned. On May 16, 2009, B.O.B. released a cover of Manu Chow's Mr. Bobby, and revealed he wanted to be known mononymously as Bobby Ray while also claiming he was taking his music in a new direction now I go by the name Bobby Ray. Make sure you put Bobby Ray. I'm really going into a new direction, more free and not trying to live up to any particular genre. I don't feel like I've been doing that. I don't feel like I've been trying to fit in, but I feel even more free-spirited. I have more willingness musically. That's all I'm about. I'm about guitars, chords and keyboards. On June 22, 2009, B.O.B. released his fifth mixed app, appropriately titled B.O.B. vs. Bobby Ray. The mixed app, reminiscent of T.I.'s T.I. vs. T.I.P., 2007, was mainly produced by Fury and B.O.B. The mixed app also included a song produced by Red Spider, titled Fly Like Me, and another titled Put Me On which is a remix to A Tribe Called Quest's 1990 hit, Benita Applebaum. Reebok used Put Me On in celebration of the Reebok Classic Remix Collection. The track is available for download exclusively to customers who purchase styles from the Reebok Classic Remix Collection, at Foot Locker stores nationwide. During the summer of 2009, B.O.B. joined fellow up-and-coming rappers Kid Cudi and Asher Roth for the Great Hangover Concert Tour. On January 13, 2010, B.O.B. announced his debut studio album, tentatively titled The Adventures of Bobby Ray, was expected to be released on May 25, 2010. To promote the album, B.O.B. announced a mixed app titled May 25, in reference to his album's release date. May 25 was released on February 1, 2010, to critical acclaim. The mixed app features guest appearances from J. Cole, Asher Roth, Playboyter, Charles Hamilton and Bruno Mars. The latter of whom was featured on the bonus track and B.O.B.'s debut single, Nothing On You. 
due to the commercial success of his mixed app May 25 and his single Nothing On You. The release date of his debut album was advanced to April 27, 2010. Three other singles followed, Don't Let Me Fall, released April 6, 2010, Airplanes, April 13, 2010, featuring Hayley Williams, and Bet I, April 20, 2010, featuring T.I. and Playboy. -ta. A video for Bet I was released on Atlantic Videos on YouTube. B.O.B. Presents the Adventures of Bobby Ray was released under Atlantic and T.I.'s Grand Hustle imprint, featuring guest appearances from Loop Fiasco, T.I., Playboy Ta, Haley Williams, Rivers Cuomo, Rico Barino, Janel Money and Bruno Mars. The album, released April 27, 2010, was given generally positive reviews. His album sold 84,000 copies in the first week and debuted at number one on the Billboard 200. It made B.O.B. the 13th solo male artist to have a debut album arrive at number one in its first week. In July, B.O.B. announced he will go on tour, naming it the Shooty End for Stars Tour. The dates and times were released on his website on July 13. B.O.B. has received nominations for his album, Singles, and himself by the BET Awards, Teen Choice Awards, MTV Video Music Awards, and the new Sucker Free Summit. Airplanes was featured in the trailer for the upcoming movie Charlie St. Cloud and his single Magic featured him in an advertisement for Adidas Magic Campaign. B.O.B. was announced to be a performer at the 2010 MTV Video Music Awards on August 18. He was added to the lineup of Eminem, Linkin Park, Kanye West, Drake, Usher, Paramore, Florence and the Machine, and Justin Bieber. On August 14, 2010. Hayley Williams announced via the official Paramore fan club that B.O.B. would be the main support for Paramore's November UK tour. B.O.B. also opened for Eminem and Jay-Z's The Home and Home Tour at Comerica Park. B.O.B. also did a MTV Unplugged session. He performed songs off his debut album, as well as a cover of Kids by Management, with guests Robin Thicke, Melanie Fiona, and Janel Money. B.O.B. also made an appearance in Lollapalooza 2010. B.O.B. made an appearance at the 2010 MTV VMAs on September 12, 2010. He performed parts of both his singles, Nothing On You with Bruno Mars and Airplanes with Hayley Williams. B.O.B. released his seventh mixed app, titled No Genre, on December 7, 2010. B.O.B. presents the Adventures of Bobby Ray was certified gold by the RIAA on December 16, 2010. B.O.B. was named Best New Artist by iTunes 2010 Rewind Chart. 2011-2012, Strange Clouds and the Man and the Martian Jesse J. released a single featuring B.O.B., titled Price Tag, on January 30, 2011. The song was quick to reach number one in the United Kingdom chart selling 84,000 copies in its first week of sales. On March 22, 2011, Electronic Arts released the launch trailer for the upcoming first-person shooter Crisis 2 which featured a song by B.O.B. titled New York New York containing the main piano chorus from the song theme from New York, New York commonly sung by Frank Sinatra. The artist who sang the chorus is unconfirmed. The full song later appeared on his eighth mixed up EPIC, Every Play is Crucial, which revealed that the song was produced by Mike Caron. In early 2011, Odd Future's Tyler, the creator released a song titled Yunkers. In the song Tyler raps, what do you think of Hayley Williams? Fuck her, Wolf Hayley robbing him slash I'll crash that fucking airplane that that faggot nigger B.O.B.'s in slash and stab Bruno Mars in his goddamn esophagus slash and won't stop until the cops come in. In response, on March 25, B.O.B. released No Future a song in which he takes aim at the hip-hop collective and their leader. In June 2011, it was revealed that B.O.B. was featured and produced a song on Tech and Nine's 12th studio album, All Sixes and Sevens. The track titled Am I a Psycho? Features rapper Hopson as well, who also seems to have issues with Tyler, the creator. B.O.B. also appeared on the official remix to Kesha's hit single Blow. The remix was released to iTunes on May 17, 2011.
In the summer of 2011 B.O.B. was announced the new face of T.I.'s clothing line AKOO. He will be featured in AKOO Clothing's upcoming Fall 2011 national advertising campaign alongside Curtis Granderson of the New York Yankees, Carl Crawford of the Boston Red Sox, and star of the bet hit sitcom, The Game, Jose Chanchez. He will be appearing in a graphic novel for AKOO titled Hide in Plain Sight, Saving the World from Fashion Conspiracy. On August 27, 2011, a video appeared on YouTube of B.O.B. performing at Colorado State University, where he previewed a song titled Strange Clouds, and announced it features Lil Wayne. In an interview with Syracuse University's The Daily Orange, B.O.B. spoke of his second studio album for the first time. He went on to say it's a more mature sound but nothing too experimental. It's a happy medium between the sound of B.O.B. presents, the adventures of Bobby Ray and the mixed apps, so everyone should be able to enjoy it. I'd say I'm 90% done with it right now, but the album title is still TBA. On September 23, 2011, B.O.B. released a trailer, through his website, for the upcoming single Strange Clouds. The trailer announced the single will be officially released October 3. The single leaked prior to the release date on September 25, causing the single to be released on iTunes on September 27. Later that day B.O.B. appeared on an online video stream on radio station V103 and announced the title of the album to also be Strange Clouds and was set to be released in early spring of 2012. Bobby Ray held the first listening session for his album Strange Clouds at Tree Sound Studios on October 25, 2011. Seven new songs were previewed during the listening session, including the promotional single Play the Guitar, which features Andre 3000. Other big guest appearances confirmed, as the album was not fully complete, include Lil Wayne, Big K.R.I.T., Nelly and a song with T.I. titled Arena. In addition he has worked with One Republic on a song and has been quoted as having, the song of 2012 with a mega feature from somebody who never does features with anyone. On November 15, 2011, B.O.B. revealed he will be releasing a mixed app titled EPIC, Every Play is Crucial, prior to the album's release. The mixed app was released on November 28, 2011, featuring guest appearances from Eminem, Mos Def, Roscoe Dash, Meek Mill, and Bumby amongst others and included production from Ryan Tedder to Lil C and Jim Johnson. While on set for the Strange Clouds music video, MTV interviewed B.O.B. and confronted him of a rumor that he and T.I. are working on a collaborative album. B.O.B. responded, the joint album, it actually started as a joke. Tip would always refer to me as the Martian, and in one of his lyrics, he said, it's the man and the Martian, and we said, man that could be an album title. We kinda just played around with it. But it seems to be taking form in a very organic way. On December 1, 2011 B.O.B. appeared on New York City's Hot 97 radio station and confirmed that he and T.I. are indeed working on a collaborative album titled The Man and the Martian. On December 22, 2011, B.O.B. released a snippet of Play the Guitar, a promotional single, featuring Andre 3000 and a sample of Fancy as performed by Drake. T.I. and Swise Beats. Play the Guitar was later released to digital retailers on December 27, 2011. On February 14, 2012, B.O.B. released a trailer for the second official single, So Good. The song, produced by Ryan Tedder, was released on February 21. In 2012 in an interview with Popkash, B.O.B. expressed his desire to work with Kid Cudi, James Blake and Skrillex, I would also like to work with James Blake. That'd be crazy. I think me, James Blake and Kid Cudi should do a song and it should be produced by Skrillex. I think the sky would fall if we did that song and the sky would come down to earth and party with us. On March 20, 2012, B.O.B. released the second promotional single from Strange Clouds titled, Where Are You, B.O.B. vs. Bobby Ray. So Hard to Breathe was released as the third promotional single on April 17, 2012. B.O.B. appeared on Hayley Reinhardt's debut studio album Listen Up. On the intro track Oh My. Strange Clouds, B.O.B.'s second studio album, was released May 1, 2012, to critical acclaim. 
The album debuted at number 5, on the US Billboard 200, with 76,000 copies sold the first week. Both of Us serves as the album's third single and was sent to Top 40 Mainstream Radio on May 22, 2012. The song features American country singer Taylor Swift. It debuted on Australia Top 50 Singles Chart at number 46. The song sold 143,000 copies first week, along with the album release, debuting at 18 on the Billboard Hot 100 and became the week's top debut. 2012 Present, Underground Luxury and Rock EP On October 9, 2012, B.O.B. was featured on the annual Bet Hip Hop Awards Cypher, alongside his Grand Hustle label mate Ziggy Azalea, T.I., Chip and Trey The Truth. On November 15, 2012, B.O.B. released his ninth mixed app, entitled Fuck em We Ball. The mixed app features guest appearances from T.I., Juicy J, Mac Miller, Playboyter, Snoop Lion, Spiday and Iggy Azalea, with much of the production coming from B.O.B. himself. The mixed app also spawned a single, with the release of the club banger, We Still In This Bitch. In early December, B.O.B. revealed to MTV plans to release a rock music-influenced extended play, I've been holding back so much rock for so long. I have been performing with my band for a while, so I guess this is a real good canvas for me to paint on. No one's really expecting anything so I can do what I want to do. He also spoke lightly on his third studio album as well, My Album is basically a continuation of the adventures of Bobby Ray and Strange Clouds. I feel like it kinda bridges the gap between where all my fans are and finally getting everybody up to speed on what my sound is and exactly where I'm going. While filming the video for Memories back then, in an interview with Wrap Up, B.O.B. spoke on a series of projects including his third album, A Rock EP, and the Hustle Gang compilation. Wrap Up TV caught up with Bobby Ray, where he stated his Rock EP is in the works and will reflect his diverse influences, when I drop it, everyone's gonna have an orgasm. It's really how I fell in love with rock music, from indie to alternative to classic rock to even some forms of country music. He spoke of his third album, which is nearing completion. This problem is a lot more effortless than anything because I've really shown the full spectrum of what I can do musically, so now I'm just having fun with it. I'm 24 years old, so I'm partying. In March, B.O.B. teamed up with fellow Atlanta rapper Big Boy, of Outkast, to release the official theme song for the 2013 video game Army of Two, The Devil's Cartel. If pre-ordered the rappers were also playable characters. The song, titled Double or Nothing, was accompanied with a music video directed and produced by Vice, Noisy and EA. On April 4, 2013 B.O.B. revealed he would release his third studio album before the rock EP he had previously announced. On April 22, 2013 it was announced B.O.B. would tour with fellow American rappers Wiz Khalifa, A$AP Dollar AP Rocky, Trinidad James, Joey Bada, and Smoke DZA for the Under the Influence concert tour. The tour would then begin on July 17, 2013. On May 12, 2013 B.O.B. tweeted, Underground Luxury. Coming this summer. Stay tuned, revealing the title of his third studio album. In May, B.O.B. also premiered a music video for a newly released song of his titled Through My Head. The video was directed by Peruvian film director Ricardo de Montreuil. On May 13, 2013 radio personality funk master Flex premiered Headband, featuring two Chahines, the lead single from Underground Luxury. The song would be released to retail on May 21, 2013. The song has since peaked at number 65 on the Billboard Hot 100. B.O.B. later revealed in an early September interview, that the album would be released in December 2013. On September 10, 2013, the second single from Underground Luxury, titled Ready, was released to iTunes. The song, produced by Noel Detail Fisher, features fellow Atlanta-based rapper Future. In September 2013, B.O.B. revealed he has planned to launch his own record label imprint. During an interview, he stated I'm putting my CEO pants on, man. 
I'm finna start a label called Ham Squad and I'm looking for artists to be the flagship artists for the label. So I'm really excited about that. In the same interview he announced Underground Luxury, would be released in December. B.O.B. called his third album a career-shifting project, adding that the album will revolve around how his life has changed since achieving major success. On October 15, 2013 the music video for Ready was released. On October 17, 2013, during an interview on Bets 106 and Park, B.O.B. announced that the album would be released on December 17, 2013. Discography B.O.B. Presents, The Adventures of Bobby Ray, 2010, Strange Clouds, 2012, Underground Luxury, 2013. Awards and Nominations <laughs>